Hi, this is Paul from TradeTheFifth.com, and I wanted to put together a small video journal, a trading journal for uh, a stocks day trade that we did on Friday the 9th of November. My trading team and I uh, put together both futures and stocks trades every day and send them out to our memberships. Uh, there'll be a link below this video uh, where you can have a look at those memberships. Now, the, with the stocks day trading membership, we use different type of strategies. But this one trade in particular um, was one of six or seven on Friday uh, that we used our black box breakout indicator suite for. So this is LMT, Lockheed Martin, on the five minute chart. You see right down at the bottom left, this first grey candle was the open. This is our special W5T EMA cloud here. So this is an exponential moving average cloud, which is a very, very um, current in both this uh, black box breakout indicator and in all of our other suites. So we see the move up. Now we get this initial high around about 309.73 or something like that. And then we pull back down and we find support in our cloud. Now this is the perfect opportunity. And then our black box breakout indicator gives us our signal. 309.72 was the entry and prints the 308.72 as the stop loss. Now sensibly, I called out the trade here to go in just above the high of this pivot here. So slightly higher than our software indicated. Now on our Twitter feed, which gives alerts directly to your phones with push notifications here, we can see here on LMT, the time frame five minute, the long entry was at 309.75. This is down at the bottom of this Twitter feed and the stop loss 308.70. So then we, in the next five minute candle, we got the entry. So before I go on to how we manage this trade, I just want to talk about these gray and blue candles here. Now these are neutral candles, okay? So the black box breakout indicator works with our uh, EMA cloud, but also it works on price action and volume and combines them all together. So these aren't good signals. Uh, we don't get the signals on these red candles, but then we get the green candle here, which denotes increased volume. Then we get increased volume again. Uh, so we get this signal and that's the move here. And as you can see on the five minute chart, we continued. We touched the cloud again and continued to go higher. Great looking signal. So how did I manage this? Let's go to the one minute chart. This was the entry here for LMT. Now we got the entry. And then as I managed the trade, I tweeted out um, for that to go and uh, so our members know how to manage this trade. Again, this is a day trade. It's a quick impulse move. And uh, I just wanted to take the profits really quickly. So the first option when I go to the first on, um, we are just at the stop to 310.27. As you can see where my cursor is here on the Twitter feed. So 310.27 is here so I locked in 50% now what happened was um, we got this big move up through this half percent and then we gapped up and moved even higher above the hundred percent times risk so the first trading stop locked in 50% we're now risk-free then we continued this move higher I'll just leave this on the chart so we can see so I then adjusted the trailing stop to 310.97 okay so we just move this a little higher okay 310.97 so what we do now once we've gone from green and we're now getting gray bars on our one minute the volume is starting to drop so this is indication we need to be really aggressive with our um with our management strategy so then the next one as you can see here i adjusted the stop to 311.42 so we can see 311.42 here once we uh, move through the 160 percent times profit i get this um, red candle which means we've got increased volume to the downside so this is potential some exhaustion on this initial move so i move my trailing stop to here and it got taken out okay so we took 160 uh, percent profit times risk on that trade in less than 10 minutes uh, you can see then we go back to the five minute there was then a pullback 
tested our cloud then we got another signal at 311.43 with a stop loss 310.47 again that entry took probably um, 5 10 15 20 25 30 minutes to get there but once it triggered we again we go again and we got another entry here to go higher and then obviously so we've got two or three more opportunities during that day to trade that one um, stock now with our black box indicator suite I've got my watch list here which changes um, on a week week to week basis but we get those signals printed out on the 5 the 15 the 30 the daily whatever one we want to set up so our black box indicator allows us uh, and pushes those um, scan results and those signals either either short or, or long on the different time frames into our watches to give us that alert so that's a quick trading journal of a uh, a very quick trade on LMT but it just shows you how we can use this for day trading stocks our black box breakout indicator so have a great trading day and I'll speak to you all very soon